It was the 59th annual Bean Pot here at the TD Bank Garden, a game that was toe-to-toe -to -toe throughout. Boston College, the number one nationally ranked team, upset Northeastern University in overtime, 7-6. It's just a great experience for me. I mean, that's what I dreamed of growing up as a young guy there to try to have a chance to score that game winner. And uh, thanks to my linemates, they're getting a puck on net, and I'm just going to the net with my stick on the ice. I got a chance to cash in there. And that was a toe-to-toe -to -toe game. What is it that you guys had that Northeastern didn't tonight? Uh, I don't. I'm not sure what we had. I mean, because we knew Northeastern was going to be a really, really tough opponent. I mean, they came out flying and they scored a lot of goals. They matched everything we did, and I think we just got a, a bounce at the end to go our way. Uh, certainly, yeah. Uh, we had to get up off the floor a little bit because Northeastern tied it late, late in the game. And uh, I thought during the intermission we were just talking about let's let's keep pushing and uh, see if we can win this thing uh, fairly early in the OT. And uh, I thought that Brian Drummond made a terrific pass across to Chris Kreider. And Chris won times it on his forehand, which is hard to do. And Jimmy Hayes was there for the rebound. So I uh, certainly feel uh, very, very excited about winning a big pot. You guys are... Right now, ranked number one in the country. How well do you think you played tonight? You know, I think in stretches we played very, very well. But our Northeastern did some things to us that uh, caused us some concern. And But good teams do that. So, our, you know, we've got a very, very good hockey team, but we're still we're trying to get better. Talk about those concerns that you speak of. Well, they got a shorthanded goal against us, uh, and that's the first one we've given up all year. But a terrific play by the young guy. Uh, they scored two power play goals against us uh, that we take great pride in our penalty killing. So we certainly have to tighten those areas up for Friday's rematch. And talk about Friday's rematch. You're facing the same team three days in one week. Yeah, I mean, uh, it was important for us because we're trying to win a league championship and secure our, our automatic, uh, you know, another trophy. And to do that, we're going to have to uh, be successful in, in these next two games. It just happened to be against Northeastern again. You guys had some really wild fans. Talk about how much energy they gave the team. Yeah, I think over the last number of years, our, our student body has become much more active and much more vocal, and our, our, we really appreciate that, and hopefully that continues. And can you talk about the physicality in the game? The first period was pretty nuts. Yeah, it's, it's a hard game. Northeastern plays our very, very uh, physical hockey, and I think we pride ourselves we can do the same thing. And our... So there's a lot of body contact and one-on-one uh, -on -one battles that, you know, they won some, we won some, but it was a, a very entertaining game to watch, I think.